game losing street with a magnificent display against the Swans at the Sydney Cricket Ground. The Demons made their move in the third quarter when they kicked nine goals to three and finished the day with a ten goal final term. Jakovic booted eight and Bennett seven for the winners. Coming off a horror stretch, five losses on the trot, Melbourne needed to start well and it was their skipper Gary Lyon who booted their first. And sneaks it in for a goal. Sydney replied quickly when Barry Mitchell, Mitchell found Jason Love with a clever chip Mitchell to open their account. But the Demons built on their lead when Eichold and Spalding combined and when Alan Jakovic took this beauty, the visitors led by 19 points at the first change. Coach John Northey demanded the same brand of football and Darren Bennett didn't let him down, kicking three for the quarter. The going had been tough for some players, with Mitchell refusing to lie down for the Swans kicking two on the run. Fires away, swings it back, right through the middle for a goal. But the second term belonged to the Demons, and they'd stretched their lead to 23 points. After the break, Melbourne continued to be effective, using Bennett and Jakovic to perfection. Jakovic is going to get this one, and buries it. A great mark by Jim West did salvage something, but another rally by the Demons made the difference 64 points at three-quarter time. Bennett breaks one tackle, kicks and goals. There was no stopping Melbourne in the run home, and they cruised to an 83-point win. To the ladder, and it's the same old story, with the Eagles on top.